Hey guys, Kevin Hughes, Artistic Director for Moroccan Oil, and we are here in New York City at the Academy. And I'm just gonna quickly show you guys how to eliminate this frizz that happens on hair. Sometimes you can get the curl out, but you're unable to get that frizz out, especially in this gloomy day that we have happening in New York City right now. So the products that I'm going to be layering are the Moroccan Oil Treatment Light, as well as the Moroccan Oil Smoothing Lotion. What I did was I brought the Moroccan oil treatment throughout this section first, and then as I'm gonna demonstrate right now, is show you the smoothing lotion, how much I'm going to be putting in into this last section. But you can see the difference in her hair just from me applying the Moroccan oil smoothing lotion. It's a tremendous difference, but I'm gonna blow your mind with how we're gonna get that super silky, very shiny and frizz free. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this last section out of her hair. And what Brittany did was actually just go through her hair um, with the flat iron and she was still unable to get rid of a lot of that frizz, which happens with a lot of our clients, right? So I'm using like a little dollop of the smoothing lotion and I'm going to work it in between the palms of my hand. I'm going to pick up my section and work it very gently all the way from the top. And you can see the shine popping out already all the way through down to the bottom. So this is a smoothing lotion. It's designed to do this. So that's why you're seeing the effects happen immediately. And you can see the difference in her hair. Now what I'm going to do is go back in at the bottom and work in sections. Let me turn her just a little bit. And you don't wanna work in too thick of a section or too thin of a section with a flat iron. You wanna sort of have like a nice medium amount of hair. I'm gonna take that section. And the reason why I, I recommend going through the entire head with your smoothing lotion and Moroccan oil treatment first is so that it has the ability to uh, as, absorb into the hair. So when you go in with the flat iron, you're not hearing a sizzle or anything like that. We don't want our client to hear that. We just wanna use the heat to smooth that outer layer and work that smoothing lotion right into the hair. You can see how it just lays down that cuticle layer. And my iron is also on 380, so it's not a high setting. That's also very, very important because Brittany does have uh, chemically treated hair. So I'm gonna take that next section again, nothing too, too thick. My product is already throughout this entire section. And you can even see the differences from this side to before the iron and then after the iron. So it really makes a big difference in the hair. This is also great for second, third, you blew out your hair, you spent a lot of time on it, you had a little bit of bad weather, so you really don't want to wash your hair and redo it all. So going over it with that smoothing lotion and that flat iron, sealing that outer layer, it just brings out the shine. Another section. And this is another good tip. I'm holding it away from the head, elevating that hair. And when you go in with the hot iron, when you press down, the heat escapes right out of the sides. So what you wanna do is always give it a very gentle tap, and that way your client, your guest, is not feeling it. It's not shooting onto their scalp. And then you can, as you get further away, just press and hold a little bit longer. I like to do quicker strokes and a little bit faster and go over it and over it. I find that it's a bit less, uh, a little less damaging to the hair. A little bit, uh, a little less intense maybe, I guess we should say. And again. If your sections get too big, just break them in half. Tap, tap, tap. Okay, we don't want to let our client feel that heat. And you can see the instant shine that happens, which is incredible with this product. 
and I'll just do this last little section so you guys can see. And then what I'll do, and you can see that annoying little bump in the hair that you get after you try to blow dry your hair. It's not perfect, so this flat ironing just brings it a lot flatter to the head, gets rid of that bump, and you bring out all that shine. And the great thing is that this will last a lot longer. So because we're really sealing down, especially with the product. And then I'll just show you how when you comb through, sort of the before and after. Okay, Just so you can see from side to side. So you get this beautiful shine, gloss, and weight to the hair. And this will keep it from getting that outer layer of frizz if you step out into inclement weather. So thank you guys, I hope you enjoyed that little tip. Um, you can find me on Instagram at hair by 11. It's spelled out and um, hope you enjoyed it. Have a good day.